Hello, I'm Bruce Yang, and today I'm going to take a look at a series of levers upon levers, or what I consider to be a reverse mobile. Now, I've always considered mobiles to be an excellent lesson in balance. The bars and blocks act as a series of first-class levers. Its location, however, makes it very difficult to study. Now, instead of hanging from the ceiling, I have a couple different sets of blocks that the students can work with. I have a set of rectangular blocks and a set of patterns that go with it. Students can follow my patterns or make up their own. I have another set called the Leaning Tower of Pizza Boxes. In this set, students have to stack them in such a way that it doesn't fall over. Now, I think this set is the most challenging. I have several strips of wood to act as the lever itself. These thin blocks will act as the fulcrum. We can hold it the narrow way, which is a normal way. Well, if you're starting out and want it to be a little bit easier, you can turn it sideways, which gives it a little bit more support. And lastly, the weights that I'm going to use are these several blocks here. Different sizes and shapes make it a little bit more challenging. We start off by making a single lever. We can add as many blocks as we want to to each side and still get it to balance. Or we can add a second lever on top of that first one and get it to balance by adjusting the fulcrum. There we go. And we could add a third on top of that also. Here we have four levers. The idea is to just keep building up and see how many levers we can get stacked on that single lever at the bottom. Now move these blocks out of the way and take a look. We have the base lever with the second lever a third lever, a fourth lever, and a fifth lever, all balanced on that base. And if I add another one to the center, that's going to make six. There we go. And in this case, I have nine. And all these levers are balanced on that single fulcrum at the bottom. And that's the challenge. Now, it does require a little bit of skill and patience. But when you're successful, it is an excellent lesson in moment of force or torque center of gravity and levers. All right, I'd like to thank you for stopping in and seeing me. Come back again. Bye.